Good afternoon, guys. Happy Monday to all your sunshiny faces. Oh my goodness, guys. It's still kind of early. I'm going to take a shower, actually, and head to bed, though. Um, just because, like, Matthew went to bed at, like, I don't even know, like, 8.30 or something like that today. Like, he went to bed super early. I swear, guys, I'm always tripping over the dog's toys. Um, anyways, we, oh my gosh, guys, today it is so stinking freezing cold out. It was a high of like 62, I think, today. And like after the sun went down and we were out at football practice, it had got to be like, I don't even know, like 40s or something like that. I don't even know what the temperature is right now, but my air conditioner is in my window and so it's so cold in there. Like it's so much warmer in every other room in the house but my room. So I've cut my North Face on in my bedroom because of how cold I am. Um, but I'll probably wear like my, like, I don't know if I'll wear my robe to bed, but it's like so freezing cold. Like, I don't know though. Cause like bliss always winds up in my bedroom with me. And it's not so much that I'm cold when I'm in bed. It's just like when I get up to have to turn off my alarm clock, then I'm like, Oh, it's too cold to get out of bed. And I just go back to bed. <laughs> like that's what I did this morning. Cause I was actually up like decently early, but I don't think I got out of bed. Like I was up, but then I was kept going like, oh, it's too cold. I'm going back to bed. <laughs> I was like, I'll just lay here for a couple minutes. Then I fall back asleep. So I don't think I got up to like late 10 o'clock, something like that. 11 o'clock ish. Um, like, you know, probably 1045 or something. But um, yeah, and then it was freezing cold out of practice today, guys, which I am like, so frustrated because we found out that two of <laughs> well we found out yesterday one of the kids is um has got to go to a wedding on saturday night um or saturday and our game's at like 6 30 at night or whatever right so we we're like oh my gosh we're gonna miss him so we, my dad came to practice like okay we're gonna have to try and figure out someone to put in his spot and move people around and stuff like that and whatnot so we're like okay you know like we can do that we come to practice we find out another kid has to go to a wedding on saturday night and we're like oh my gosh are you kidding me so we had to put like all kinds of kids in different positions and it's like getting down to the wire too where like we need to really win these last two games or else leave it up to fate and kind of be like well we'll just you know like if the teams that are in front of us lose their next two games and we also lose our next two games like that might put us in and like you know but it'd be really difficult and like so the best we can do is like win the next two games and hopefully the other two the other teams lose the next two games like we're still in it even if we win the next two games and like there might even be a possibility where we don't even make it and we'd end up with a winning record which is crazy but um because we would be five and four but we still might not like make it into the playoffs so anyways long story short guys um all kinds of like craziness is going on this week and like all the parents were trying to convince the one kid who was at practice for some reason the kid that told us yesterday who he was like oh yeah I'm not going to be there on sa Saturday for the game he told us this yesterday at the football game um he wasn't at practice which my dad was like I actually think that they told me that he wasn't going to be at practice for some reason tonight so anyways though um yeah that and then the the other kid came to practice and we're like tell you know you're gonna have to have your parent call like one of the other moms and like she's gonna try and convince him that he should stay and like if they're nervous too because I guess they have to go out of state for the wedding they were like well then you know like he could just stay it over at their house because they're like good friends with them and stuff like that and so she's like trying to convince him that he needs to stay here and stuff like that and you know I don't know like if it's like a really close family member if it's kind of someone a little bit more distant or like what what it's going on and so my dad's like well I'll talk to your dad like you know we'll see if we can get you to go and then I was like the same thing with the the kid that told us yesterday Jack really good friends with him like they went to the middle school together or the elementary school they've been friends since they were like he's always been a year older than Jack but his younger brother is the same age as Jack so they've been like always really close we had to drive a different kid home for a football practice tonight and so like the car ride though they to go drop him off I was like well maybe we convince his parents then like he could stay over at our house because since Jack, you know, they've known him for so long and we don't really know the other kids parents like that well or anything like that Even though the the other kids older brother used to play baseball with Matthew when they were little because they're both the same age So, um, you know, but my dad was just like, yeah I was like or if not like they'll just all come over here and we'll like they'll just all have a big sleepover or something like that Because they're like we're like we can't lose them like, you know it's been really difficult when we've been down kids, but especially like our our uh, skill players, we've really, I don't think almost ever been at without one of our skill players. And so it's so, like it's just so scary that like we might be out two of them in one 
for one game and especially in a game like this that matters a lot in order for us to make it to the playoffs we're like kind of freaking out right now but the two kids that we did have in there they took some reps so I guess it's good that we got the you know we found out early and not like you know Friday we're like oh yeah he's not gonna be there for the game or something like that like that would be scary but you know we found out luckily earlier in the week at least so that we can get the the subs that would be playing their position now in because like we do have a rotation if like one of them gets hurt or two of them gets hurt or whatever we can kind of like you know we have some people that can go in but you know again in a game that matters a lot <laughs> it's gonna be super scary to again just not even have like a sub to go in because we're using our now our our backups and trying to figure out where kids can go and stuff like that and so again trying to figure that out we had like three or four kids that weren't at practice today and they were two of the kids actually that we were going to put in those skill positions but they both weren't there one actually hurt his pinky yesterday in the football game and hopefully it's not broken but um it was like bruised and kind of nasty looking so hopefully again he is there tomorrow um but again like you know with him not being there when another kid that we were thinking about putting in at a different position is just like craziness guys this is getting down to the wire and you know possibly being out kids like freaking out here guys <laughs> freaking out guys um but yeah we I felt like it was a good practice though they actually came in really focused which I was surprised about because every other game that they've had a win the very next day they come and they're all talking and you know like oh my gosh we did so well and you know all that kind of stuff and I think they just like get that big head. not the big head but they also kind of get that um you know where they're they're um they just lose focusness and then they're talking about like oh yeah you know like it was so cool when you you know got that touchdown or whatever and they just talk about stuff like and go over the game like so much that it's like guys stop focus you know put that out of your head you need to get ready for next week already and so yeah, that's kind of one of the scary things um, in the last couple weeks. But this week, I felt like they were really focused, which was good. Unlike the last couple days where I was like, oh, I'm going to keep the vlog shorter. Um, today, I am like, going to go take a shower and head to bed. Also, because I'm freezing cold and I really like to go take a warm shower. So, I will see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog. If you guys did enjoy today's, make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love it if you'd subscribe. And I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow. So, bye guys.